What's going on everyone and welcome back to another high quality foodie feature for you here on the channel where this time I'm over at Denny's to check out one of their all new LA favorites and being that I've never had a burrito from Denny's like ever I'm actually going to be going in on the Cali chicken burrito so stay tuned because it's up next. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian K. Stay frosty. So here we go with the LA Favorites Cali Chicken Burrito here at Denny's. And I gotta say guys, initial first impressions, I'm a little underwhelmed with the size of the burrito itself. I mean, I've got plenty of chips here for sure, but the size of that burrito is already suspect. So let's break this one down. What you're looking at here is a grilled flour tortilla that's filled with seasoned chicken breast, fresh avocado, cheddar cheese, normally pico de gallo, and ranch dressing. But guys, the quantities of each of these is looking a little on the light side. And as you can see, this looks very, very small for the price point of $9.99 overall. So yeah, definitely no bueno. This burrito does not feel hefty at all. And considering it's supposed to be a Cali chicken burrito, I was expecting something a little bit more substantial in my hands. But what are you gonna do, right? It is what it is. Off to the side and filling out this container is plenty of their house-made chips here. And as you can see, there's a decent amount of them for sure. And for dipping, we're gonna go in on some queso dip. So this is looking pretty good already. I can't wait to do that. But guys, again, coming back to the burrito, definitely no bueno situation in the size department. But let's see if the flavor is gonna deliver on it. This is the LA Favorites Cali chicken burrito here at Denny's. Let's peep out this flavor. Yeah, man, definitely not filling the size on this one. And while I do like the size of the chicken breast pieces in this for sure, they do feel like they're kind of filling out the little half that I have here. This was already pre-cut. I'm really not filling the overall size for the price point. But again, what are you gonna do? Like I said, it is what it is. So let's just hope the flavor delivers on this one. Here we go with the LA Favorites Cali Chicken Burrito here at Denny's. Let's do it. Well, I mean, the flavor so far after that first bite is not bad. The ranch with the chicken, of course, is a beautiful situation. And the fact that it's grilled chicken on top of it as well, you can really taste the nice flavor of the ranch with it. And of course, the creaminess of the avocado. Not bad. I just wish it was a little bit more heftier in my hand. I mean, this really feels like a small burrito, guys. It almost feels kind of like a Taco Bell type of burrito. It's that type of thinness. And even though it's kind of chunky the way that it looks here right now, not enough on the inside overall. But the flavor so far is doing a pretty nice job here. Not too bad in that department. You know, I'm almost thinking I probably should have asked to keep the pico de gallo on the inside of this burrito because then maybe it would have filled it out just a little bit more. Probably not that much, but even still, it would have added overall to it there. But even still, like I said, guys, not too bad for what I've got here. And that's strictly in the flavor department. And speaking of flavor, really fast before we go any further, let me grab a little bit of the queso action for you. And as you can see, this is looking pretty good. Hopefully that's going to focus in. There you go. Queso action with chips. How bad could this really be? House made. So naturally, these are super fresh right now. Nice and hot. Let's go for a little dunk. It's nice and creamy. As you can see, it looks like we've got a little bit of pepper action in there as well. Let's try this with the queso real fast. Mmm. Oh yeah. Elevated saltiness on this, but man, that queso is smooth. I wanna say Monterey Jack cheeses in this, but man, the peppers on this, wow. That's actually pretty nice. I'm gonna have to go for a little dip with the burrito action here, guys, but this is actually a very nice add-on lovely situation this is a highlight right now mmm oh yeah and because I just mentioned it let's not wait any further on that let's go for a little dip with this quote-unquote mini burrito almost like a chimichanga without the fried action right there hopefully you guys are seeing that that's keeping the focus but lovely situation with that queso let's try it with this mmm that's a ticket right there mmm saltiness with the avocado Oh yeah, and the ranch is beginning to pick up a little bit. That's actually nice. You know, it's funny, minus the avocado, this is pretty much any standard generic type of chicken burrito that you can get, but when you add avocado, everything becomes Cali apparently. I guess they associate California with avo, but as you can see, let's go for another Dunkin' here. Another lovely situation of goodness. That queso is awesome. Light heat, light spicing that I'm getting from it, but the cheesiness is banging with it there. And again, it's got that saltiness. It's really elevated nicely. And again, the ranch is coming in with it. Let's keep going in. Mmm, ma'am. This is the ticket, it really is. And just to chase that last bite real fast, let's go for another chip. Kind of feel like I'm doing more of a queso show for you right now, but guys, this is a major highlight. It's actually almost better than the burrito that I'm having. It's really, really tasty. I'm pretty surprised. Mmm, really good. And again, that combination of the avo along with this queso and a little bit more flavor that I'm getting from the cheddar cheese here. Let me keep that in there as well too there along with that chicken. It's really a nice combination. This should really be on the inside of this burrito if you ask me. That's really what they should have done with this. Mmm. Absolutely. 
So yeah, guys, not too much else to say about this one right now. The disappointment is real in terms of the price point and the size of the burrito itself. I mean, I know you're doing takeout and it's typically more of an expensive cost because it's Denny's anyway. Pricing is generally kind of average, but I gotta admit with these quote unquote LA favorites, I'm really hoping this is gonna be just a little bit more substantial in the hands to be more like a Cali burrito, something that you can really wrap both of your hands around. But as you can see, what we've got here is a very similar Taco Bell type of situation, to be honest, with some really good queso on the side. I'm glad I got that, because that's what's really gonna help this along. But on its own, this is just okay. $9.99, definitely not worth the price point for that. Definitely not. Well, this was my first and probably only burrito that I'm ever gonna get over here at Denny's, unless they advertise something that's actually in the picture with somebody holding two hands to hold it, something substantial that's really worthy of the LA favorite's name, at least a Cali chicken burrito. Something a little bit bigger needs to happen with this, and for $9.99, you think it would've. So with that said, I'm gonna have to give the LA favorite Cali chicken burrito here at Denny's just an okay seven out of 10. And that's really helped along because of the queso situation. On its own, it's just above average. Aside from the price point and the size, the flavor actually does deliver pretty decent. I have to admit it's solid. The quality of the avo is pretty good. You can definitely taste the creaminess, it's fresh. But like I said, once you add that queso into the mix, that needs to be a standard ingredient on the inside of this one. And they need to lower the price point by like maybe three bucks. Then it would be worth it, just saying. All right, so I've got one basic question for you. If you've been to Denny's most recently, if you've ordered from them direct, have you actually seen these on the menu in your area? I'm very curious to know if this is available across the country and not just here in Southern California. Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Yeah, I sure do love the slick packaging this one comes in, Denny's, but let's try and fill it out more with the actual entree that's supposed to be in it, not necessarily the chips on the side. I mean, there's a lot of chips in here. Come on. All right, guys, until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Hey, thanks for checking out another one of my reviews. But just in case you didn't see the one before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's going to recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.